like pizza? Welcome to Brewing Review. When I'm cheers, cheers. Bed, I'm watching Brewing Oh, okay, I kinda like this, that's interesting. Oh, baby, Corey, what are we drinking today? Today we've got, no, yeah, just a really nice beer from Bell's, Easy Drinking Golden Ale. Kinda sounded like I was just describing it, but that's the title. <laughs> no, yeah. comma, yeah, just a really nice beer. I do laugh though when beers advertise easy drinking, like beers are trying to be like, look, it's really tough to drink this one. It's kinda like solid -y. it's hard to get down yeah, the right? But this is, it's like a summer beer if I've ever had one. I have no clue what the taste, I'm not a, Somalia of beers. Right, right. I have no clue what the taste is that I'm getting on this, but I, I dig it. There's like a little aftertaste. Yeah, there's something there. That, that comes in that I think is fantastic. Corey pointed out it's got all the little Midwesternisms. Like, oh, excuse me. Oh, yeah, for sure. Watch for deer. Just gonna sneak past you. Just gonna sneak past you there. Um, oh, this will be a good one. Oh, guys, don't forget to like this video. It helps the algorithm and it helps number six, which is a lot. Oh, How about this? What? I forgot to change my shirt. All right, we film a lot in the same day. Let's want to do a... Yeah. And there we go. There it is. That's how easy it is. That's how you do it. Guys, while you're watching this video, how about this? If you're from the mid Midwest, or even if you're not and you know people from the Midwest, what's your favorite Midwesternism? Uh, oh, yeah. Mine's probably, oh, yeah, for sure. I think that, like, because that's one ice. I always, I over talk for just confirming yes to somebody. Mine suck my <laughs> Uh, what is that, Iowa? <laughs> and then today, food-wise, Palermo's Field Neighborhood Pizzeria. This is their sausage pizza. Oops. Oops, sorry, but let me sneak past you there. Um, yeah, so Palermo's the owners of Screamin' Sicilian, Urban Pie, others. This is just their straight up sausage. And they've been doing it since 1964. And the Faluca family, those, those folks still work, we met the younger Nick, when we went to Palermo's, that family still very much in the process of making these pies. That sounds like a bad, a bad word in Italian. Faluca. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This goddamn Faluca cut me off in traffic this week. <laughs> hey, up yours, you jerk! Hang on, Quagmire. I gotta kick this guy's ass. Yeah, I gotta kick this guy's ass. All right, so let's dive in, huh? I'm getting this big sausage beast right. That here. does look like a good one. Look at that boy. Mm. Oh, come on, don't do me no. There you go. Don't pay me no. Never mind. I got a lot of sausage on this one, so I'm trying good. To I lost some cheese. Damn good. I'm gonna go like this. All right. In this video, you're gonna find out if you should buy this or not. Cheers. Oops, sorry. I don't know what kind of <laughs> cheers I just got. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know if it's the copious amount of sausage I had in that bite, but that was amazing. Mm-hmm. Wow. This is damn good. It's very good. This is damn good. This is like one of my more enjoyable frozen pizzas I've had in a while. I agree. It tastes less frozen than others. Also, the flavor's just kind of better. I think Palermo's is doing something in that building that we toured, they're doing something different there. Food just kind of seems to taste better out of that building. Yeah, the sauce doesn't have that weird saucy, mm -hmm. that frozen pizza sauce taste that you get sometimes. It's metallic. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm, good crust, the ingredients are good, cheese is great, this is fantastic. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. You've just excited Corey with the frozen pizza, so you basically won life. That's Corey Wagner's stamp of approval, that goes a long way. Mm-hmm. I want to get your head cut out in one of the stamps. That'd be sick. I gotta, go. I gotta go another one, and I need some of that hot or sixer sauce. Granted, even though it's yours. Wow, man. I'll actually put one of these pieces in my pocket and save it for later. Yeah, dude. Right in the breast pocket? Right next to the pizza slice. Put it right by your, by your heart and be like, hey, this is where you're gonna end up clogging this bad boy. Yeah. At least you're up front about it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be on the train on the way home on the L, and you look over and you see a guy with a piece of pizza in his pocket. Would you cool. respect that, man? Yeah. Tell you what, with Sixer sauce, I do think this is the best sauce for uh, pizza. Yeah, I'll do it with you. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh, also, how great is it? I know it's not Screaming Sicilian, but it's the same brand. We have the Screaming Sicilian pizza plate. Also, guys, would you ever want a number six with cheese pizza plate? We've kind of had little mutterings of wanting to do it in the future. Let us know if you'd like that. I like that. The answer is yes. This is damn good. It's very, very enjoyable. Even though, like, crust isn't bad. Look at this. Mm. Look at that frozen pizza, doesn't it look good? And I really like that. Once again, the answer is yes. So why is it called Palermo's if their last name's Fettabini? Fettuccini's. Faluca? Faluca. Maybe it's after their village, Palermo Villa? Yeah, like the villa in Italy? That must be like a city they're from. It's like if I open a pizza place here, I call it Toledo's. Yeah, Ooh, like his yeah. last name's Wagner, why does he call it Toledo's? It's where he's from. He's proud, of, he's proud of where he's from. Man, this is a great combo today. I. Love this beer. Mm -hmm. I've been saying for a while I'm off the hop train. Mm -hmm. I think maybe Golden Ale is my next thing. This mm -hmm. is damn good. The pizza's good. The sauce is great. The beer's amazing. I'm in heaven. What a Friday for you. 
You got the right shirt on now? <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. Wow, I'm really impressed by that. Me too. It takes a lot for a frozen pizza to impress me. I know. I feel like a happiness radiating off of your my aura, your cuts, your cut muscles. Me yep. up. All right, before we go ahead and officially endorse or denounce this pizza on YouTube and Facebook, let's do a shout out. Let's do it. PayPal shout out, PayPal shout out, PayPal shout out. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to support the show and you don't want to sign up for a recurring payment on Patreon, which is what Patreon is, you can do a one-time donation on PayPal. A lot of people have been doing it. The link is below if you'd like to donate. It just takes you to a straight-up donation page off PayPal. And as you know, PayPal links to like everything, so you can just like take money out of weird funds that you're storing, you know, and, and send them over to us. Um, also on our YouTube banner. So shout out to everyone who has donated on PayPal, and shout out to everyone who will. You are with us. You are respected. You are loved. Yeah, because the because the frozen pizza wasn't free, right? No, this cost us real, actual human money. Corey does our accounting, so I, I don't know how that works. <laughs> this food just shows up. <laughs> Corey like swipes up. Anyways, all right. Moment of truth. Thumbs up or thumbs down. Eric McCluskey, our resident drummer, just off off camera. Drum roll, please. Thank you, sir. All right. Thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not we liked, we enjoyed, and we think you guys should buy this. The Sixers. Should you spend your money on this frozen pizza? Are you ready? Yes. Ho! That was amazing. One of the best. I thought it was very good. There was something about like frozen pizzas are a little, always a little off. They're actually usually a lot off from regular pizzas. Yep. This was still not a regular pizza, but less off. I completely agree. Than most frozen yeah. pizzas. If, you, if you're moving the needle in that direction, you're doing something right. Right. The less offness, the better. Yep. Uh, Palermo's doing it right. Might be the kings of the castle when it comes to frozen pizzas. I mean, they do have a palace. Right. A villa, if you will. Should we just end on that? Sure, sick brag. I mean, we've been to Palermo's home, so yeah. no big deal. Yeah, we were invited to the actual villa and given guest passes to see how the donuts are made. Time to make the donuts. Guys, we'll be back here Monday for a brand new video. Five videos every single week, sometimes more. Thank you for rocking with us. We appreciate all of you. Thanks for making this show go for five years. Sure, I'll have a drink. I like that. Uh, sometimes more, never less. Kind of good. Exactly. Five videos a week, sometimes more, never less. That's kind of good. Yep, absolutely. Put it, it on rolls a off the tongue while we put it on a billboard. Lamar. People don't use billboards anymore. Oh. <laughs>